What's up guys, back with another video of uh, Angels Talk. I was planning on doing a little recap after I saw this series went out. You know, we just got swept by not one of the greatest teams in our division. And now we're stacking up against the A's who have been on fire. And so I was I was a little nervous about this series. But, uh, you know, I was hoping the offense would get going. And they did on a big night. So let's get into this. Got Julio Tehran starting on the bump for us. He had a pretty good outing last time. But he was on a pitch count because he had just gotten done with COVID. And, you know... He had to be watched a little more by Madden, so he gotta kind of got to go let it loose this time. Gets out Ramon Liriano, Matt Olson, and um, Marcus Simeon to start the first. Looked really good. They had Sean Manai on the bump, who's uh, not been their best starter, but their whole pitching staff's been pretty good, so I was a little nervous for this. Trout, Trout was going to get it started. I felt like it, but he had a Fletcher on base, and he, he manufactured his own run there on the pass ball. Uh, Trout still gets on though, and then Rendon finally gets his season going. It's a really nice bomb to left field. This got me pumped up. Finally seeing him swing the bat well. I knew it'd just be a matter of time. He's just got to get adjusted. I think we'll be fine with him. First inning got cut short by a ground ball double play by pool holes. He's not going to beat any of those out. So we knew as soon as it was hit the third, Matt Chapman was going to scoop it up, and that inning was over. But we got a 3 0 lead. Felt really good going to the second. I was, I was pumped to see our offense get some runs in, but then. Matt Chapman came up, and he just dropped a nuke over the left field fence, and he's a stud defensively and now coming to his own offensively. So he's, he's a guy to worry about whenever you play them. Um, Tehran kept going, you know, top of the second, only giving up one. They get this little fly ball out to right field. Adele did not come in on it enough to get the guy going home. They score another run. Now it's 2-3, runners in scoring position. And now we got two outs, and pass ball gives up the, the lead. Now we've got a tie game. Getting a little nervous here as the Angels fan, you know, we were used to our pitching doing this kind of stuff. But he finally gets out of it with ground ball to Rendon. We got Upton coming up doing his his normal Upton thing, strikeout on the ball, six feet below the zone. That was awesome to watch. And then we got two outs here in the bottom of the second, runners in scoring position, and we do what the Angels have been doing, and we get out. Come up to the top of the third, and we continue to give the game back by letting Matt Chapman hit. Um... Just, just not a very firm fastball up in the zone. Tehran is like the fourth lowest fastball velocity in the league, I believe, and he just left that up and right down the middle. We uh, finally get out of that inning, only giving up two. It's five to three, bottom of the third. Pulls comes up, hits a rocket down the left field line, but Matt Chapman, that's not, that's not going to get past him. He plays so deep and he plays so well that he's not going to let that get down the line. Probably would have been at least one RBI, maybe two. Um, but yeah, he stopped that one. And then we get Upton back up. He finally gets an RBI, and, um, you know, he, he got a little lucky here. Simeon probably normally makes that play, but we'll take it. We get uh, bases loaded, two outs, and we've been pretty terrible with the bases loaded. And you can see Adele strikes out there. That shut down that little spark we had. We give them the bases loaded with one out here, and Chapman does another another amazing feat here and scores three RBIs, ends up getting a triple out of it. And um, Matt Olson almost beat Ramon Liriano there to home play, as you see. Uh, I guess Liriano was waiting to see if anyone would catch that, and they did not. So now we got an 8-4 game. Upton gets a fly ball here that we think he's going to catch, and it tips off his glove. So this is kind of what I was talking about last time about the defensive war. I mean, he's not no outfield stud, and he hasn't been hitting great. So that that's what we got there, 9-4 game on that error. And then Trout does Trout stuff, gets a little two-run blast to left field out there. He turned on that pitch very nicely. Obviously, it's Mike Trout, and um, got, got a little fire in our team maybe. Hopefully, we got runners to second and third here. Pujols hits a little chopper up the middle. We're uh, smart enough to score on it. He's not beating nothing out, like I said. So now it's 9-7. Noe Ramirez comes in, who's actually been pitching pretty good. He gets a line out by Matt Chapman, first guy to get him out that night. And we double off Loreano here at a second. That's a really, really big play right there for our team to get him out and get two outs out of it. And then Otani-san comes up with the freaking bomb to right field. This was a nice swing. We get him, him hitting. Him, Rendon, and Upton have all been hitting below 160. So to get him to hit and Rendon to hit in the same night with power like that, that was awesome. And then here's the third of that group, Upton doing his, his normal stuff. I just love him so much. He's he's awesome to watch right now. Then we get Trout coming to save the day once again with a tie game 9-9, the bottom of the eighth, one out. He comes up and hits another home run, his second of the night, his fourth hit. He's, um, he's definitely putting us on his back right now, carrying us to victory. And then... Ty Buttry comes in, closes out the game. He gives up a nice little shot here, but we finally put Brian Goodwin in the outfield, took out Upton, got that dub. It was uh, nice to see the Halos win it.
All right, guys, that's going to do it for episode two of Angels Talk. Really appreciate you guys checking in. Please subscribe, hit the like button, turn on notifications. I appreciate all you guys coming through. I got more Angels episodes coming up and um, some other ideas with just baseball in general. So please stay tuned, stay ready. I appreciate all the support. Thanks.